Hi again, everyone. We are officially wrapping up day two of JSA TV and JSA podcast here at Capacity Europe 2023. We're on the floor. It's been busy. Candice, how have the interviews been going so far today? They've been going really good. Uh, really great, you know, vibes overall at the at the event today. Uh, we've been blessed with beautiful weather today. Actually, I haven't been outside since I walked in. <laughs> Not even so. sure that's true. <laughs> I don't know. Really, you can yeah. never be sure in London. But so as far as content, we've we've been hearing, you know, de definitely some common themes that have come up over and over. Um, we've been hearing about bringing in new talent into the industry, retaining existing and in incredible talent, uh, automation customer service, you know, how to generally how to keep up with uh, the incredible demands. And, you know, from all regions of the world, too, that's one thing that I really love about Capacity Europe is it brings together not just European companies, but, you know, APAC, um, we've got, you know, U.S. in the house, uh, we've got Canada. Um, so we've even just here on JSA TV, I believe we did 20 interviews over the past two days. Um, and, you know, we've we've we just um, had a uh, Radelit um, from Italy uh, talking about um, uh, that region of the world. And then we've had, I think, three um, African operators and infrastructure providers. Um, we've had companies from Germany and Amsterdam and London and U.S. And so, you know, it, I really love the diversity um, from a geographical perspective. Of yeah, it continues to be a conversation around bringing the global community together to support right. global expansion and, and facilitating the increasing uh, you know, demand that that is has been the case for our industry for right. a long time, driven by things like AI, which I I don't I find interesting that the conversation has evolved a little bit. You know, from you know a few years ago, we were really talking about we need to get ready for this. You know, the demand that's coming, the infrastructure we need to build to support it. Now I'm finding a lot more people talking about how they're utilizing mm -hmm. AI in their uh, in their organizations to support their customers, and I feel like that's been an interesting conversation. Yeah, I've been absolutely. having with folks. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. That's right. That's a that's a huge one. AI, you know, everybody's basically talking about it. There's always going to be several panels uh, at, at these uh, conferences. And by the way, I did uh, sneak up in between interviews and and uh, attend the, the messaging platform um, or the messaging panel. Uh, uh, a couple hours ago, and that was very well attended. You know, standing standing room only. People were uh, definitely tuning in for that, and it's really nice. It's uh, on kind of on the left side of the big expo hall this year, um, so it's kind of weaved in nicely with the rest of the event. Yeah, and so we're not done. I mean, we're done for JSA TV, but tonight the awards are on the Global Carrier Awards. And yes. You're attending. Mm -hmm. It's exciting because mm -hmm. in addition to many JSA clients, um, Greener Data, uh, brought, which uh, of course JSA has brought um, together mm -hmm. uh, collaborators from across the industry to talk about what we're doing to support sustainability and, and the future of our industry and the planet. That's up for an award. Yes, it is yep. up for best marketing campaign. So I will be in the audience cheering it on. Uh, good luck to all of the other um, shortlisted uh, companies and campaigns. Uh, very exciting um, evening. And I'm just really excited to, to spend another evening with uh, the excellent folks of the digital infrastructure industry tonight. Yeah. So until we meet again, which will probably be soon, uh, that's a wrap for us uh, today, uh, for this week, for JSA TV here at Capacity Europe. But we'll uh, we'll be bringing to you soon more news that will continue to come out over the course of the week and, of course, months ahead. Yeah, we'll be at uh, DCD Virginia um, uh, shortly, and we will be, of course, back at PTC. We've been yeah. talking to folks about that already. So we've got uh, a lot of events coming your way, a lot of great coverage uh, with uh, leaders in the industry. And until then, as we always say, happy networking. Happy networking.